When entering the Vancouver International Airport and walking through its vastness, you are bound to come across a jade green sculpture of multiple figures in a canoe. This is the Spirit of Haida Gwaii, created by Bill Reed, firstly as a small clay prototype in 1986, and this specific reproduction was cast in 1993, installed in 1996. The biggest question remains, who are these figures? What do they represent? This is a reconstruction of a Haida canoe with 13 figures, all with a connection to Haida mythology. To begin with, each of these characters, Bear sits at the bow of the canoe with his wife and their two cubs. There's Beaver, who hoarded all the fresh water and fish in the world at the bottom of the ocean. And then Wolf, with his hind claws in Beaver's back, both not native to Haida Gwaii. According to legend, they were brought to the island by a magical gust of wind. Next is Dogfish Woman, a figure who is a humanoid deep sea huntress with gill slits on her cheek and a pointed head. Mouse Woman is also present, hiding. Mouse Woman guides those from the human world to other non-human realms, while her grandchild Raven, a trickster, sits at the stern and appears to want to guide the canoe's direction. There is also the conscripted oarsman. He represents us, the common people, making the world go round while obeying orders from our superiors. Eagle and Frog are represented. The former with his wing bitten by bear, so he takes it out on bear, who he bites with his beak. Now for the centerpiece, according to the label nearby, possibly represents the spirit of Haida Gwaii, with his staff topped by an orca. As the artist Bill Reed states, there is certainly no lack of activity in our little boat, but is there any purpose? Is the tall figure who may or may not be the spirit of Haida Gwaii leading us? For we are all in the same boat, to a sheltered beach beyond the rim of the world as he seems to be, or is he lost in a dream of his own dreaming? The boat moves on, forever anchored in the same place.